Good morning, everybody. This is Ronald Lavelle with Tough Daddy. We are at Sip and Dip in Fall River, South Main Street. We just got inside. We got some nice pumpkin iced coffee. And I gotta tell you, it really is good. It's got a nice pumpkin-y taste. And yeah. We also got the Asiago uh, bagel. Bagel, thank you. And also a, a blueberry corn muffin. And we've got the bagel with chive cream cheese. Now, Sip and Dip is well known out in Rhode Island. It is and Fall River, too. Well, there's only one in Fall River. And there's like two in Tiverton. And they have them in a few other spots in Rhode Island. Oh, look at that. This is the bagel. Isn't that nice? Look at that. Look at that. The cream cheese that they're getting is Philadelphia. Mm. That's that's a good cream cheese. Oh yeah, chive and onion, by the way, one of my favorites. And I believe they make everything fresh here too. They do. And the one thing that I used to always liked about uh, sip and dip, so did my wife, was that the at one time they were the only ones that gave like the shave type ice on their ice coffee. And it was really good. Now it looks like they just give regular ice, like Dunkin' Donuts and everywhere else. But the coffee is still really good. The other place that used to give shaved ice was uh, Tim Hortons. Mm. It was like a shaved crush kind of ice. Yeah. Made the coffee so much like sweeter and nicer. Oh. Uh, that's a good bagel. Good flavor. Not too doughy. Cooked just right. And that cheese on it. I baked into the bagel itself. Good. And they also do smoothies here now too. And they also have like breakfast sandwiches and stuff like that as well. This bagel with the Philadelphia cream cheese. It's good. This is the blueberry corn muffin. Good story it is. Could have had them heat it and or toasted it with butter, but as you all know, I don't like butter. And since Ron and I are sharing, all right, blueberries baked right into it. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Not oh, bad. Actually, just the way it is, not dried at all. Not cakey like either. It's uh, nice. The blueberries kind of give it a nice sweet flavor. Well, uh, uh, actually, not the name. Yeah. Uh, this here was just a short little mini review. Uh, we just figured we're in the neighborhood. Let's go by to get some mm -hmm. sip and dip and do like a little uh, video for all of you on really the coffee is what we were planning on. But, you know, you see stuff that you don't normally see it today, like uh, blueberry, corn muffin, or that... Uh, Asiago. Yeah, or that Asiago bagel. You know, hey, they had to change the plans. But I did like that Asiago bagel. And who doesn't like Philadelphia cream cheese? But this coffee is very good. I got, I normally drink my coffee black, as many of you know. But I did get this one with almond milk and Splendor. But I gotta tell you, it's really good. You can definitely taste the pumpkin. To me, it tastes like pumpkin pie. It's just like a pumpkin pie with face. But they do have, like Bruce, uh, like I just said not long ago, they have like these here. And they say with rare fruit. And then, of course, they have like some breakfast sandwiches. Like yeah. ham, egg, and cheese, bacon, egg, and cheese, just a regular egg and cheese or just an egg. Uh, I saw a sign that said that uh, the veggie omelet fact for a limited time. We only have a few flavors that are sugar-free. 
pretty much anything that's under selected is uh, like no sugar added, no sugar, sugar free flavors. And then, of course, they have the flavors with the sugar too. And then the ones that are not sweetened are on the side that says standard. If yeah, look standard. At the sorry, not selected. Standard. They also got hot chocolate here, and oh, they've got a sign that's right in front of us that says like frozen lemonade, ice cream favorites, and straight up fruit, creamy treats, energy infused. They take like energy drinks and they infuse it. I'm guessing with coffee, with tea, or something. Well, anyway, I mean, that's pretty much our little mini review special on Sip and Dip. Uh, if you'd like to see us come back here and maybe try something else on the menu, like one of their breakfast sandwiches or something, please let us know in the comments below. With that said, you know, we just want to thank you all for always tuning in and watching. Thank you all for all of your love and your support. Truly means a lot. All of this is possible because of you. Uh, if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell, both are free and it highly helps out the channel. Also, too, please head on over to Facebook and Instagram. Give us a like and follow over there if you haven't already. And if you have, another big thank you. The like and follow button is also free. If you'd like to pick up some merch, though, some Food Level Review Show merch, you can do so by uh, just going to the link, which will be down in the descriptions below and also right at the end of this video. Everything you buy from the merch store goes right back into the videos by helping us go to more places and film more episodes for all of you, the viewers. And again, just thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. We love you all, and we'll see you on the next review.